Is your ghee cultured or non-cultured? Have you ever been informed by your Ayurveda or yoga expert about which type is considered true Ayurvedic ghee? If you love your toast but your tummy doesn't, think ghee. But not just any ghee. Let's talk about the king of clarified butter. Welcome to the golden world of ghee, where not all jars are created equal. Imagine you're choosing between two superheroes. One has the power to just fight villains, while the other can heal the citizens too. That's kind of like choosing between non-cultured ghee and cultured ghee. Now, non-cultured ghee is like your regular superhero. It's great, it's powerful, but it's straightforward. Made by simply boiling butter and removing the milk solids, it's all about the fats without the frills. But then there's cultured ghee, the superhero with healing powers. It starts as cultured cream, which means it's already been fermented before it even becomes ghee. Why does that matter? Fermentation brings a bunch of good bacteria into the game, making this ghee not just a food, but a healer. It's like it has a PhD in fixing your digestion and boosting your liver health. Why is this important? Ayurveda, India's ancient wellness science, has always favored cultured ghee. It's not just about the taste, it's about the benefits. Cultured ghee aligns with Ayurvedic principles, supporting your body's inner balance and digestion. So next time you're at the store, eyeing that shelf of golden goodness, remember, it's not just about butter, it's about better butter. Choose the one that not only melts in your mouth, but also loves your gut. Consult your Ayurvedic expert Gurnam Saini in person or online at Pure Herbal Ayurved Clinic to know more.